Hi guys, this is Dormouse03. Welcome to my Evil Within 2 100% walkthrough where we are getting 100% of the achievements or trophies in this game. This is chapter 17 and we just beat the final boss of the game, but it's not over yet. Uh, we still have a little bit left to do here in this chapter. It's very short and it's a lot of cutscenes and stuff. So I'm not going to be talking a ton, but there is one final collectible that we're going to be picking up and then uh, doing a short little action sequence and, and finishing up this game, guys. So if you've been with me the whole way so far, uh, we're about to grab a bunch of difficulty Almost achievements. There. Because this was done entirely on Nightmare, and so we should get all three of our difficulty achievements at the end here, pick up the last weapons. It's just uh, a bit of a nice little a nice little haul here at the end. So Establish contact, sir. Where is he? We can't get an exact location. Wait! The core has been located. The marker is approaching her. Excellent. Instruct the marker on how to re-establish the core. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, sir, but it's too late for that. The environment has taken too much damage. Even with the core back in place, total collapse of Union is imminent. So be it. We still have STEM. We can start again. But we need the core. She's too valuable to abandon. Have the med team prepare for core extraction. How much time? Depends on how fast he can get her to the extraction point. They're close. Shouldn't be long. Med team in place and standing by. Once extracted, have the med team terminate the marker. He served his purpose. Yes, sir. Shit. Kid. Call your man and give him instructions. Well, I guess this is it, kid. Kid! Did you hear me? Yeah, I did. Is that insubordination I'm sensing? You can't kill him. Yes, we can, and we will. Once he's back in the real world, he'll become a liability. Now, call him and tell him where the extraction point is. Come now, kid. He signed his death sentence the moment he entered STEM. Now, do as I've ordered, or you'll be signing yours as well. No. A shame that you'd attempt to betray us. I had such hope for you. sequence he here is with Kidman and we are kicking the butts of these Mobius guys and so you know they're, they're, they're all shooting you And you just want to, you have unlimited am ammunition here, and so you just want to kind of get, get on target and then wait for them to pop up. And then just sort of pop up and, uh, and get them a couple of times. Oh, come on, dude. The bullet sway here is ridiculous. 
or the the target's way. The uh, the aiming is the word that I'm looking for. All aiming here is not the best. Shit. Lily, she's got to be in her room upstairs. All right, so Lily has got to be in her room upstairs, but we have got to go to the living room because we have a collectible to pick up. And I love this one. This is going to be mysterious object number eight. The mysterious toy. And that is our achievement all in the family collected all of the mysterious objects and so so this was the last one and it's the keeper <laughs> from the first game which is fantastic uh, you find the design of this toy deeply unsettling but something compels you to pick it up you don't want to carry it around with you but you decide to keep it in your room for safekeeping there was a lot of the word keep in that little blurb about the keeper ha 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 so that was that that was our last collectible and now we are we are free to head to the finish line here so lily's room is over here It's me, Lily. I'm here. Is it really you? Shh. It's really me. I'm here to take you home. You mean we're not home? No, baby. But we will be soon. So tired. Go back to sleep. When you wake up, we'll be safe again. Myra. I've got her. Come on. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm sorry, Sebastian. I can't. Yes, you can. I'll carry both of you if I have to. No. But I'm not... Mobius has to be stopped. Screw Mobius. We've lost too much time to them already. We can get away. Just the three of us. We'll go someplace where they'll never find us. There's nowhere to hide. They're everywhere. Lily will always be in danger. Unless I destroy them. Okay, fine. I'll wait. Once Morbius is gone, It doesn't we'll... work that way, Sebastian. It can only be done from inside. Stem is more than just this place. All of Mobius are connected to it via the chips in their heads. Once I assume the power of the core, I can transmit a signal just as Union collapses. A signal that can take Mobius down once and for all. But we're finally together again. There's no other choice. This is part of the plan. It always has been. I'm sorry. Myra. Shh. Just promise to take care of the little one. Never let her forget how much her mother loved her. Myra. There's so much I want to say to you. I've been watching you all this time. I know how you've suffered, what they did to you. 
what I did to you. You didn't ask for any of this. And you've been into hell twice for it. It's time for you to leave now. To live the life that was taken from you. I love you, Myra. I love you too. Both of you. That's why I'm doing this. But there's no more time. You have to go, now! So, uh, <laughs> I do, I do like the little cuts between, between Sebastian and Kidman. Like, they work pretty, pretty well. Oh my goodness. Are you serious? Come on, if we love the gun, Kidman. not to get shot too much but this isn't it's not too harrowing actually you know you can get shot a little bit as evidenced by me getting shot a little bit and you know you take them down pretty quickly come on dude get shot in get to the, the stem room. just need to make it downstairs Okay. So yeah, so it's nice to uh, to play as Kidman a little bit here. I think that this was this was nicely cut together with you know the transitions between her and Sebastian. Almost there. All security personnel report to the. I like it, but that was the last enemy of the game. So. I hope this works, Myra. Just murdering doctors. such power and now you choose to throw it all away why after all you've seen all you've done why the crisis of conscience now is it for the detective for the child no it's for me think about what you're doing kid STEM is needed. Imagine it! A unified consciousness for all mankind. No more wars. No more disparity. No more pain. No going back now. I hope you were right, Myra. Sebastian! Kidman, I've got her. Where do I go? Get to your room. All right. But Myra's staying behind. You know why. 
Okay. We don't have much time. I'm counting on you, Kidman. Now we run. Don't and he, he auto sprints. We're almost there. And has infinite sprint, which is nice. So we're just headed toward the big shining oh light of the mirror in our room. Trying not to get smashed along the way. This is really just a cinematic sequence, you know? It's a it's a playable cinematic sequence, which is nice. I, I like it when games give you control. Like this. It's just it makes it feel a little bit better than if this was just a cutscene, because it feels like, you know, we're running toward the finish and A little bit more in the home Just gotta hang on. It's not too late to stop this kid. If you do, I promise to kill you quickly. Otherwise, the punishment for your betrayal will be legendary. I'm going to be legendary, all right. Legendary for taking you down! A world without choice isn't a utopia. A hive mind only works with a queen that controls it. Join us or die? Well, guess what? There's a third choice. And that's fuck you! You are foolish! But Ogden, Adam, it's a shame to have to lose you like this, kid. What? You thought that I was just flying by the seat of my pants here? I took my ship out three days ago. No matter! You'll die today. One way or another. Hello, Sebastian. We're almost out of time. You did it, Myra. I knew you would.
Take it easy, Sebastian. You're safe now. Lily. Where's Lily? I need your help getting her out. Stand over there. Yes, Lily. It's really me. I... I was having the worst nightmare. Shh. I know, Lily. But you're awake now. The nightmare's over. There's nothing to be scared of anymore. It really is, isn't it? I'm not still inside there. Just thinking I'm... It really is over. Thanks to Myra. Come on. Let's get the hell out of here. That is the end of The Evil Within 2. Um, and I just want to say, I think it was a nice touch that she was uh, older. I I don't know, I worried when I was when I was watching it that she still looked like a little kid. And it was nice to see that there was that continuity between she looked the same age in STEM because you know, in her mind, she hadn't really grown up, but, and in everybody else's mind, like, that's how they think of her, because that's the last time that they saw her, right, was when she was younger, a few years younger, and, you know, when she was, she, when she was taken out of the actual core, you know, she, she looked older, her hair was longer, uh, she looked a little bit of a bigger, of a bigger kid. Um, and I like that because, you know, I don't know. I just know, I, I notice things like that. So I appreciate it. We've got a couple more things here, uh, at the end. There, there's a few more little cutscenes and things, uh, and then we should be popping our achievements. There's an ordinary world 
Here come some achievements. We have complete the game on Nightmare Difficulty. We have complete the game on Casual Difficulty <laughs> or higher because these all stack. So those popped. Uh, and then Survivor, which is complete the game on Survival Difficulty. So all three of those should unlock with Clearing Nightmare. And now we have New Game Plus, which we are going to definitely be going through in order to, in order to get um, our last uh, achievements for Upgrading everything, upgrading your, your skills, upgrading your weapons, and all of that good stuff. So there's a few things we have left to do still in addition to Classic Mode. Uh, so Classic Mode difficulty has been unlocked. Abandon all hope ye who enter here. Uh, we get 60,000 green gel, which will go a long way uh, toward helping us with our upgrades and you'll be able to start using it from chapter three. A lot of these upgrades and things, uh, the things that you unlock, you are able to start using in chapter three because chapters one and two are, are really, um, you know, not, you aren't into the game proper yet when you're in those chapters. Got some outfits. And we unlocked the Magnum, uh, which you unlock for defeating the game on any difficulty. And you get the Brass Knuckles, which is uh, for, for beating the game on Nightmare or higher. And we also unlocked the <laughs> Cinematic Letterboxing, which is, you know, what the game was on, what the original game was on with those black bars and things. So we unlocked all those things, uh, which we will be able to use in our next playthrough. So we overwrite that save file. And so now we have the little symbol there of Mobius uh, that indicates that that is a clear save. And that is that, guys. So that was our first full playthrough of The Evil Within 2. That was on Nightmare Difficulty. And at the end of Chapter 17, or throughout Chapter 17, you should have unlocked All in the Family for collecting all of the mysterious objects. And then there at the end, we got Against All Odds, Survivor, and Rookie for completing the game on Nightmare or Higher. And we grabbed the other two uh, achievements or trophies as well. So that is that playthrough complete. Uh, if that was all you needed, uh, then I hope that this was helpful to you. If you want to continue on with me to grab the last of our achievements, uh, we're going to acquire all the standard weapons. We're going to be able to get that when we get to chapter three here. Uh, when we start a new game because that's when we when we get access to all of those weapons that we just unlocked we should have gotten all of the rest of them in in the playthrough that we just did we're also going to turn on the cinematic 
uh, mode that we just unlocked in order to get the cinematic feel. We're going to craft every type of item at least once to get Handyman. Uh, and then we are going to work on just blasting through this thing and collecting as much green gel and weapon parts as possible in order to completely upgrade all of our weapons and all of our abilities for they never even stood a chance and stick it in my veins. So I'm going to be showing you a little bit more. Uh, I'll probably um, cut through and, and only show you the bits where I'm actually getting the achievements um, because you don't need to necessarily see me play through the game again but I'll um, I'll come back I'll show you how to do do each one of those things uh, in turn and skip through the bits that you don't need to see um, and then the last thing that you will need to do is classic mode for uh, you asked for it again and my achievement guide for that is actually already up. That was the first one that I did, and so I'm going to have that at the end here of this playthrough, but just know that I did that on another account. Uh, so I did that on my main account um, when I recorded that, and then I went back and recorded this on my alternate account so that I could show you, you know, all of the achievements popping in order. So just know that that's why you know some of the achievements I think I got the ones for uh, nightmare difficulty and survivor difficulty in that one as well and that's just because that was my that was a different profile <laughs> that I was doing it on um, but to do 100% and show everything popping in order I needed to do this on a completely different um, tag and so that's that's why the difference there um, and it was just because I recorded that one first, um, and then I recorded this one second, so. That will be at the end of all of these videos, though. Um, you can look at that playlist separately, um, but I'm gonna have them at the end here, too, just because, you know, that will be the last thing that you need to do to get your 100%. So there you go, guys. Um, that was, that was it. That was, uh, that was our first playthrough. I hope that this has been enjoyable. I hope that it was helpful to you guys. Uh, and if I don't see you for the next ones, thank you very much for uh, watching watching these videos and supporting my channel. Um, and if I do see you in the next ones, uh, I will see you for New Game Plus. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you there.